The name's VR. Mac in VR. And I have a world exclusive today. I'm previewing the latest haptic feedback device by the geniuses of ProTube VR. Let me introduce you to the Provolver. Are you excited? I know I am. So let's get straight into it then. And remember, we're born to respawn. I forgot how much I love this stupid gun. Before we start, the channel is growing rapidly at the moment, so if you enjoyed the madness that is Mac in VR, please hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. I'd also like to give a massive shout out to my new patrons and thank them so much for supporting the channel. Cheers, guys. You're all legends. For reference, ProTube VR have provided me with early access to the Provolver, but I am not sponsored by them and I am free to review this device as I see fit. So the Provolver is the brand new haptic feedback device from the boffins at ProTube VR. I've had exclusive access to the device for nearly four weeks now and I'm going to say this. It's been really hard to keep my mouth shut for a month as this changes everything and I'm going to tell you why. ProTube are the kings of virtual reality gun stocks. They make the excellent ProTube VR Carbon Mag Tube, which I use practically daily when playing Onward, and the excellent ForceTube VR Haptic Feedback Module for your VR gun stock. The Provolver is an evolution of the Haptic ForceTube VR, but doesn't actually require a gun stock, as it is a standalone haptic feedback device that simulates the kickback of any weapon you are holding, and so much more. This one device is a proper game-changing innovation on our way to the full virtual reality oasis that Ernest Klein envisaged in his groundbreaking book, Ready Player One. Not the film, the book. Go read it now, link down below. Don't believe me? Watch this sequence from Half-Life Alex and be amazed. Oh shit. <laughs> Kicks really hard. That's really good. God, this game is so good. So what's happening is when I pick up the little ball of light, I'm getting a kick every time I go through one of the hoops. Like a really hard... You can actually see my hand moving. <laughs> That's amazing. So I'm clearly having a great time, but what is the Provolver? It is a handheld force feedback haptic device that can be used one-handed. Or with the addition of this handy little mount which clips to the front of the Provolver, you can also use it two-handed. Or if you're one of the lucky ones who already owns a ProTube VR with your virtual gun stock. The Provolver comes with its own custom mag cup and clips to the front of the controller using this handy wrist quick release. It is beautifully finished in quality 3D printed material Setup is a doddle, just pair the Provolver to your PC or Quest 2 using Bluetooth and fire up a compatible game. See the list in the description. Some games do not natively integrate the Provolver, but you can still use it via the companion app on your PC. The Provolver itself weighs about the same as a fully loaded 6 hour P226, which adds that extra dimension when playing, especially if you're firing a pistol in, say, Pavlov or Half Life Alex. Shall we talk about the pros and cons then? We'll go cons first, as I do like to end on a positive note. Number one, pricing in the EU is, and in the US, so it's not cheap. Two, Pistol Whip is a very physical game and then throw in the extra weight of the Provolver and it can become tiring very quickly. Three, at the moment there is limited native support but more games are being added regularly plus you can use the companion app to make most PC VR games work with the Provolver. Now the pros. 
But I suppose if you want to test haptic feedback, the best way to do it is with the most ridiculous gun in the world, the 50 caliber Desert Eagle. Let's go. You are joking me. <laughs> and that is all I'm going to say there. Using a pro vulva is like having the best girlfriend in the world, then finding out she's a millionaire who owns a pub. That would be just the best day ever. Hand on heart, playing Half-Life Alex with a pro vulva was just one of the best experience I've ever had in VR, full stop, the end. I know it's a bit expensive, I know your arm can get a bit tired after prolonged play, but it's all worth it when the feeling of nailing that perfect shot in Pistol Whip or the immersion of regaining health in Half-Life Alex actually brings the machine to life. I highly recommend this little device and I highly recommend you purchase the optional front mag cup mount so that you can use the Pro Volver two-handed. Makes Population One and Sniper Elite VR an absolute joy to play. So thanks to ProTube VR for letting me get early access to the Provolver for this review. I've had an absolute blast over the past few weeks and I hope that joy is reflected in this video. What do you think? Is the Provolver now on your Christmas list or do you think it's a bit too expensive? You know the drill, get involved and comment down below. Well, that is it for today. If you enjoyed this content, please hit that like button. The algorithm loves the likes and maybe do all the other things popping up around me now. You can also support the channel on PayPal or Patreon or by going to my shop on tshirtstudio.com and purchasing some of my stylish merchandise. My best chum Surgical has launched his own YouTube channel so go check out the link in the description below and I also stream once a week so keep an eye on the community page on my channel for times and dates. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the other side.